blew up in my Twitter timeline recently as of yesterday at the time of recording this video, which is Tuesday, April 2nd. The Twitch streamer's name is Judge FN6, and he's a white kid who is a uh, husky. I'll say that much. He has a following of 3,260 people on Twitter. On his Twitch account interludes, he has 225 followers at the time of recording. Now, what you're about to hear is uh, strange, to put it lightly. Because uh, when I saw his tweet, uh, well, let's just say that he blew up for threatening somebody while saying this word, as well as calling him by these insults. Now, without further ado, here's a video of Judge Evan Six telling. Peter bought FN to stop cheating. Yo, Peter bought, fuck you, you pussy ass nigga. You fucking hacker, you cheat because you can't do shit without it, you bitch ass nigga. Big Judge FN in here, I'm gonna shoot you with my Draco. Bow, bow. Fucking scrawny dork. Fucking pussy, I'm calling you a Grimgate in Cash Up Finals. You snitch ass bitch. You're a hoe ass nigga. How are you gonna call him a dork and a pussy when you, the one that looks like this, and says the n-word. Now, in another tweet, he responds to a Twitch, another Twitch streamer named Slash, Slax. <sighs> Sometimes this generation has the most dumbest online names that you can't even pronounce. But anyway, he called him out and, uh, Guess what his mom said in the background of his video? Yo, to all you fuck niggas who think they're gonna con us at Classy Courts, you better fucking watch out. Yo, niggas better watch out if you have a chance of placing. Me and my nigga Slacks will murk all you bitch ass niggas on phone now. If I were you, I'd land somewhere else, it's, or it's over for you pussy ass niggas. Big Judge FN out, fuck nigga. Sorry, my mistake. It was actually about how Judge FN6 and his partner are going to beat anyone at Clapsy Corpses. And he says he's going to murk all these niggas on phone Like what? And about that, your own mother told you to stop yelling in her fucking house really shows how immature you are for an 18 year old now in this tweet judge evan six responds to you old ggs for having the shittiest tweaks of all time yeah uh listen to this yo what's up boys it's judge fn here i just want to come on this and say Fuck your New World Tweaks, bro. New World Tweaks are fucking ass. They're shit. And true, listen to the owner. You're fat as fuck. Go band for band with me, you fucking broke bitch. No one buy this shitty ass nigga's fucking tweaks. He fucking scams. They're fucking ripoffs. Fuck that shit. Judge FN out, fuck nigga. Then the organization themselves tweeted, Bro, what did we do? Wanna join New World? I don't know why anyone would allow this piece of tub lard to join an organization, a gaming organization like this. But apparently, Judge FN6 did join New World GGs, and he started making a tweet 36 minutes ago the following day, and it's just so strange that a stupid gaming organization like this would ever allow a racist person who says the n-word a slang version of the n-word mind you 
which by the way is culturally stealing the African American culture of the way they speak and welcome him with open arms to the team knowing well in fact that he has said some racist shit and has threatened people acting like he's some sort of thug when he's not. But this next tweet here is where I actually decided to discover Judge Evan Six. It blew up. It has 26.2k likes and 1.9k retweets. And do you want to know what that tweet gives me? It gives me white supremacist vibes. Yo, Kanata, I saw what you said, you pussy ass nigga. Shut your bitch ass up, Ling Ling. You got built in stretch res with your fucking Asian ass eyes, buddy. Fuck ass nigga, you a snitch. Surprise your bitch ass ain't working at Panda Express. Suck my fucking dick, bitch. Okay, see, the fact that you called him Ling Ling and that you said he has stretch your eyes, like, I don't know what that means, but it kind of sounds racist. Why are you crashing on April Foods? April Fools, nigga. Nah, foods for you. Did you hear bro's voice crack? I was wondering if I was the only one who heard it. Nah, I heard it too. And as a matter of fact, everyone that's watching this YouTube video has heard it too. Bro thinks he's from the hood, fat fuck. Don't talk to my duo like that. I'm um, sorry, Slacks, or whatever your fucking name is. You can talk to your duo whenever, whatever he wants. Because this SYN Damien 7 guy has the right to explain his displeasure towards the idiotic, racist, son of a bastard who said the N-word. And you shouldn't make any fucking excuses for Judge FN6 like that. You're overweight. That's quite insane that he is like this. Alright, Deadass, this isn't hate, but you gained so much weight. This is actually sad. You're scrawny as fuck, pussy. Look at you. You can't be saying that, Judge FN6, when you look like this. Because you haven't done any exercises whatsoever to lose all of that weight. I speak for all the black community when I say it's okay for you to use the n-word. It's 2024 and if you're Mexican and you're giving a white person the n-word pass, then you're not black. And you're making excuses by allowing someone who doesn't have the same skin color to be racist intentionally. So if you're that type of person that does that, don't do it. Who the fuck is this badass pig? I know bro ain't say what I think he said. Oh, but he did. NBS, the nigga named Judge FN6. Yep, got nice like this saying nigga for clout. And apparently at the time of making this video, he deleted all of his tweets. So he tweeted, I'm back. And this is what he has to say. Yo, I'm back. I'm not going to be a little pussy bitch. Draco, fuck you, you fucking pussy. Your dick is small as fuck. You got blocked on TikTok by that ego, you fucking pussy ass bitch. Fuck all you. I don't give a fuck if you my address. Uh, first off, you are pussy because you deleted all of your tweets. Plus, if you're not going to be a little pussy bitch, then the least you can do is not delete all of your tweets. You could have just cut them up. But you can't, because you're a coward. And only a coward is a little pussy bitch. Because you know what you did was wrong. You need to lose some weight, bro. Also, stop saying the n-word. You're white. Fuck yeah, Bryson. You tell him. Fat as fuck. Friendly fire will not be tolerated. He's not fat, it's muscles. Mexican speaking for the black community. 
you not even black to be talking. You're not even black, so you can't talk for everyone. That's right. If you're technically not a black person, you cannot speak for the black people. And of course, people found Judge Evan appearing to be shaking his ass or something like that. I don't even know what he's doing there, but he kind of deserved it, to be honest. I mean, seriously. Look at his body physique. It's so bad. Why are you so fat? Yeah, Judge, why are you so chubby? Now, some people have gone through the lengths of, like, doxing his home address, if that's actually his real home address. I'm not sure. I'm just going to bleep it out just in case because I cannot confirm that it is his home being doxed. Many mechanics, but it's embarrassing to be chubby. Haha. <laughs> yes. Yes, it is. No N-word anymore, bro? You turning soft or what? Listen, Nitros, you punk-ass troglodyte. Like I said before, if you're Mexican and if you're giving someone the N-word pass because you're not actually black, don't do it. Because you do not, under any circumstances, speak for the majority of us. So quit making excuses. We made it. You do realize that you making it doesn't mean that you're famous, right? It means this is a controversy for you. Saying the anywhere does not make you popular. So as a matter of fact, Judge FN6, you have culturally stolen a word that belongs to the black people. You cannot say a slang word that belongs to them. Got it? Failure ruined your whole life for two days of Twitter likes. Where are your parents? Yep, teenagers today will always get the clout that they desperately need when it comes to them being a YouTuber or Twitch streamer. Nigga, you are so fat and disgusting. Get a job and a gym membership, Mr. Munchie. Yeah, great idea. He should go to Planet Fitness. It's perfect for people like this fat slob. Acorn FM later on tells Judge Evan Six that this wasn't funny and don't make fun of people's religion. Yeah, the fact that you go on the internet just to insult someone based on who they are and what they worship is really insane. It's insanely disrespectful at best. No way you are still standing your ground. Yeah, he is. And he shouldn't be. Alrighty, so here are my final thoughts on... Judge FN6. Judge FN6, your failure Twitch streamer and Twitter user. Because the fact that you only got clout off of being a racist person is mind boggling. Not only were you a racist to someone who's Asian, you were also racist to someone who's an Arab. And also, white people, like yourself, have their own words, like tubular. Why not use one of those white people words instead of adopting a word that doesn't belong to you in the first place? Real talk. You cannot just say a slang word that doesn't belong to you in the first place. Because black people who have their own slang words want to be different from others, like you. And all of the uneducated Twitter users who think it's okay to use a word that black people always use 
is cultural appropriation. But in reality, a white person saying nigga isn't cultural appropriation. It is culturally stealing. That's what it is. And you, Judge FN6, say you don't care about getting dogs. So why did you delete all your tweets then? But you won't be able to explain why you deleted all of your tweets. Because if you say that you're not a pussy, then you should have let them up. But the fact you, that you did makes you a coward. And a coward like yourself shouldn't be on the internet in the first place. If you're not going to take the heat for what you did. It's sad that teenagers like you want an online presence just to be racist to an Asian person and an Arab person by acting all tough like you're some big shot tough guy. But deep down, you are just a lonely, self-lonely, low-life person who probably has no real-life friends to support you. And you're the type of guy who probably got bullied in school back in the day because you were picked on and you were called names yourself. And so that's why you take it out on other people and you call them by these names. And if you actually cared about your online career that you want to do on Twitch or wherever else, then you need to act a little bit more professional for your streaming career. Otherwise, it'll be over very soon for you. And surprisingly, when I looked into your tweets, this is not the first time you've done this. Because you did this before. And you did this back in February 29th of this year, pulling of your OG a whole ass snitch. Yo, Oliver OG, you a bitch ass nigga. You ain't no OG, you a snitch, you a hoe. And then Batman Booga on March 1st. By simply calling him a hoe and a snitch as bitch. All because he hangs out with Oliver OG. Yo, Batman Booga, you a hoe. You a snitch ass bitch. That's why you hang around with that Oliver OG nigga. That's why you got dead last in grand finals, you bitch ass nigga. You're terrible, Higgs. You're fucking dog shit, kid. I own you, buddy. Fucking terrible. Just fucking quit the game, kid. 35th or whatever the fuck you got. You're dog shit. I could have got fucking better if I would have called Grins. Jesus, 1v1 me, you pussy. Overall, you need to quit this fucking gangsta, tough guy attitude because you are not tough. You're just a chubby 18 year old teenage boy with no girls and you're a lazy slob that doesn't have a real job to help your parents pay for the bills. All you do every night is Annoy your mom while you're screaming for nothing, playing fart night all night long. And don't ever say nigga ever again. That's not your word to use. Do better.